Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of HDTV Live. I am Jack Boomsma. And I'm Elliot Hartford. And uh, this week, we got uh, state football happening down in Vermilion. Yeah, that's Thursday. Well, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Uh, all the all the nine or uh, all the nine man teams play Thursday, starting at ten o'clock. That's three games on Thursday, and then I think it's two each, uh, two Friday and two Saturday. So that'll be interesting, fun to watch. A couple good teams on there. You going up? Uh, I am not. Oh, what a shame. Are you? No, I got ortho. Oh, what a shame. I'm getting my braces off, so you won't be seeing uh, brace face anymore. I think, keep, I think you need to keep them on, but <laughs> anyway, uh, so now we'll send it to Jacob with the weather. All right, it's the weather, man. I got the seven-day forecast for Hitchcock this week. Uh, it's Friday. We're looking at high of 35, low of 23, chance of snow. And then Saturday, we got a high of 35, low of 25, uh, chance of snow for that day as well. Uh, Sunday, we got a high of 35, low of 20. Monday is a high of 36, low of 26. Tuesday is a high of 50, low of 31. And Wednesday, we got a high of 43, low of 22. Thursday, high of 39, low of 18. Uh, for your seven day forecast in Tule this week, Friday is a high of 35, low of 23. Saturday, high of 35, low of 25. Chances for snow both those days. And Sunday, high of 35, low of 20. Uh, Monday, high of 36, low of 26. Tuesday, high of 50, low of 31. Uh, Wednesday, high of 43, low of 22, and Thursday is high of 39, low of 18. Thank you, Jacob, for those that nice weather update. We got a lot of weather coming up here shortly, um, so just be safe out there. You know, it's getting colder. We got snow coming here soon, so drive safe out there. Remember to bundle up and be a good person in general. Uh, we'll send it to Briar for the uh, interviewing kids in elementary. Hi, I'm Briar Close for HGTV Live. I'm here with Miranda. So, Miranda, what grade are you in? Second grade. Second grade? Uh, what's your favorite subject in school? Math. Math? What's something new you've learned in math? I don't know. Don't know? What is your favorite thing to do in recess? Freeze tag. Freeze tag? Sounds cold. And now I'm with Taylor. So, Taylor, what grade are you in? Fourth grade. Fourth grade? Uh, what's your favorite subject in school? Probably art or math. Art or math. What's something new you've learned in art or math? Or so we're doing this project. So we did this project. It's, a, it's kind of like a mess, but... With multiplication and art, we get to color. It's kind of, we did it for Halloween. It was really fun. Okay. Uh, what's your favorite thing to do in recess? Well, Harper comes up with new games. My favorite game that she comes up with is ball tag. We throw this ball at each other, and if it hits you, you're it. Sounds interesting. And now I'm here with Jack. So, Jack, what's your what grade are you in? Third. Third grade. Uh, what's your favorite subject? Mm, reading. Reading. Uh, what's your favorite book you've read? One of the I Spy books. One of the I Spy books. Uh, what's your favorite thing to do in recess? Play football. Play football. Thank you for those interviews, Dreyer. And, uh. We'll go with. Uh, no, uh, we gotta send it to Zach with sports. Oh, yeah. Uh, so now we'll send it to Zach with sports. Now I'm here with the sports update. Today we're gonna talk about the matchups for the state football championships. Uh, for 11 A, uh, Madison and Millbank will be facing off. Uh, for 11 AA, T area in the pier. And Pierre will be taking for going against each other. And for uh, 11 AAA, Harrisburg and Brandon Valley. Um, for 11 B, Winter and Bridgewater Emory. Ethan. 9 A is Harriet Selby and Howard. Uh, 9 AA is Platt Yetis, Kent and Canastota and Freeman. 
and for 9B, it's Del Rapids St. Mary's and Potter County. So, there you go. I'm here with Madison Hofer. Uh, Madison, what is you going to miss most about volleyball? Um, probably the locker rooms and just listening to music with the girls and getting pumped for the games. It was a lot of fun, so I'm going to miss that. All right. Uh, any advice for the younger uh, kids coming up? Um, probably just enjoy it while you can. Um, it goes by really fast, like everyone else says, and just got to enjoy it. Um, respect the coaches, even though sometimes it can be hard. Just respect them and have a good time. All right. Thank you. Now I'm here with Bethany Wiebe. Uh, anything you're going to miss uh, about volleyball? I'm going to miss playing the game and the bond I have with my teammates. All right. Uh, any advice you would like to give to the younger kids coming up? Um, just respect the upperclassmen and don't give up. You got it. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Hi, I'm Jack Boomsley here with Danielle Noel. So, Danielle, what are you going to miss most about volleyball? Do I have to talk into this? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> The thing that I'm going to miss the most about volleyball is probably playing the sport itself and hanging out with my teammates. I had a lot of fun, and I'm going to miss it. I see, I see. Any advice for the younger kids coming up? Gosh, um, just enjoy it while it lasts. Work hard. Um, yeah, it's good. All right, thank you. Now I'm here with Shandy Chasing Hawk. Shandy, what are you going to miss most about volleyball? Probably the atmosphere on the court. Okay. Yep. Um, uh, and then, do you have any advice for the younger kids? Um, just enjoy it while it lasts and try not to focus on the drama that comes with it. All right, thank you much. Thank you, Zach, for the uh, sports stuff. And that will be uh, interesting here at the Dome. And so, I got birthdays, as always. So, happy birthday to uh, Jaylee Gilbert and Ever Evan Kind Saucer. All right, now I got some upcoming events. Um, Friday, tomorrow, the 12th, there is no enhancement uh, or anything. And then the 15th is uh, elementary girls basketball and boys basketball JVC starting at 6 p.m. And then the 16th is uh, 1.30 is the blood drive starting here in Tulare. And then Oral and Turf Regions is that day as well. And then elementary girls and boys basketball in Washington Springs at 6 o'clock and 7 o'clock. And then the 17th is FFA Leadership in St. Lawrence. And the 18th is uh, Volleyball State, or State Volleyball out in Rapid. And uh, then we have elementary girls and boys basketball at Woolsey Westington starting at, er, yeah, at Woolsey Westington starting at 6. So, yeah. Sounds like very eventful. Very